Hi, in this video we are going to talk about the role of the team intrapreneurs. My name is Natalia Lajara and these contents have been prepared by Guillermina Torbo. We will lecture at the Universitat Politecnica de Valencia. In this video we are providing some examples from the food industry related to entrepreneurial programs. In first place we can talk about Kellogg's, the food manufacturing company that introduced a 12-person speed team that consists of people from different functions, such as product and marketing, in order to conceptualize, test and launch new products quicker than a more traditional product launch. Walmart store number 8, the tech incubation team within the big box retailer Walmart, announced the new program called Spatial Ampersand that specifically focuses on reinventing in-store merchandising with immersive technologies like augmented reality and virtual reality. As a program under store number 8, Spatial Ampersand enables Walmart to create tech capabilities to transform the future of the retail buying experience. Nestlé has created the Nestlé R plus D Accelerator based in Lausanne, Switzerland. The accelerator brings together Nestlé scientists, students and startups to advance science and technology with the objective to accelerate the development of innovative products and systems. Internal, external or mixed teams are eligible to use dedicated hot decks as at this accelerator over a defined period of time. They have access to Nestlé's R plus D expertise and infrastructure, including share labs, kitchens, bench scale and pilot scale equipment. Kraft Heinz launches its new growth accelerator platform Springboat to support small and startup food businesses will allow it to better identify new trends and the companies that are shaping them and in turn provide an avenue for investment in the rapidly growing natural food segment. A spring boat dedicated to nurturing, scaling and accelerating growth of disruptive, disruptive EU, US brands in the food and beverage industry. This platform is looking for opportunities to develop authentic brands and inspired founders that fall under one of four chosen pillars that they see as shaping the future of the industry. Natural and organic, specialty and craft, health and performance and experiential brands. Springboard will partner with existing brands, offering an accelerator program for small brands and a four-month incubator program for startups. Companies selected for the incubator program will get financial assistance and advice on how to raise additional funds as well as use of pilot plants and commercial kitchen space at the Kraft Heinz Innovation Center. And the last one, in 2015, General Mills got into the startup game with its 301 Incorporated, a venture capital platform to fund and work with emerging brands. The platform brought a new twist to a previous setup that focused on developing new business models for existing General Mills brands. While 301 Incorporated doesn't have any specific incubator program, it runs an extensive mentorship and accelerator platform for businesses that it funds. In the last three years, 301 Incorporated has taken stakes in, in 10 brands. The platform's mission is to find opportunities that have truly remarkable products and be the part of General Mills that is on the cusp of any industry trends. It brings General Mills expertise in product development with a team that can help startups achieve quality and consistency and improve product taste, appearance and texture without necessarily impacting clean label and health attributes. They also can work with supply chain and distribution issues. Hope you found this interesting. If you want to learn more about this topic, here you'll find some useful references.
Thank you for your attention.